And the turn rate. Even though we don't want to dogfight much, we don't want to lose when we do. And I mean, it helps you move better. One thing that's nice about being on the Star Destroyer stride side is there's not a million friggin' turrets masquerading as ship targets. That would be so helpful too if these got if the stars got bigger and the triangles got bigger. The closer you were, the closer they were, you know, who shot you, like stood out. God. Careful, you almost had a collision. They've taken out most of the generators. We need them. What? What? <sighs> no. Just no.
transports break free, those troops will attack the resistance. Protect them. Help them get clear. We've got it. Our troop transports are making a run for it. Why am I doing this? What is that? Smooth move. Yeah. First order transports away. That's well, it's good to be able to dodge the missiles on your own and not rely on the little system. Even though the system is pretty easy. Pretty good. But when you're in a tight space, you're going to want to be able to turn with the missile. Why? Well, I should just shut up and fly. He's mad because he ain't got 50 kills. Yay! Eh. Yeah. Boba Fett's better for kills, I think, because you can hit everybody with that thing. But I need some, uh. Vader's fun, too. I need some crystals as well. This battle is all but over. Troop transports leaving the hangar. Keep them safe. Trying to get two of them. No! Have you now? Did I defend it? Did I get points? Uh -oh. Wait, what probably wasn't close enough. I don't care. Just want to shoot people on right there. They've destroyed almost all of our transports. Well done. Our transports have successfully escaped. Why won't he die? In an A wing number. This will not stand. Our troop transports are making a run for it. That's a computer. It just saves you time to just press that button and dodge the missile and it's, and it's guaranteed. But you waste a lot of time trying to dodge that missile. And I, I do feel the need to be number one when I post. I'm usually always on the scoreboard. Uh, not number one every time. And you do get beat by uh, even when you have a crazy amount of kills. Somebody's getting objectives and with somebody on their team. 
Yeah, they're gonna outplant me, which is kind of cool, I think, actually. You dare. See, yeah, he has 20 kills, but he's got more points because he's getting objectives. Oh darn, guess I'll jump in the slave. You can drop those bombs, especially if there's objectives like there is in this they one. Well, oh, it's over now, space. but uh, drop your bomb by an objective, you're probably gonna kill a bunch of people. some fighters for me to shoot what in the hell that is not cool at all at all come on There's a target, holy cow. Holy cow, folks. I'll finish what you started, grandfather. Don't make me like What is going on there? I like that maneuver. You shook them off. Shield the down. I was so dumb what I just did. Don't shoot missiles at people. You're trying to shoot with guns. Dude, that's a little too much shaking right there. What? And I basically zero the bubble. Whoa, what did you see? Where? Pull it together or they'll have you. Did he just eat the missile? Our shields are back up. Defend the deflectors. <sighs> the rear deflector is Come on. Keep it safe. And Get you. Come on. Nobody else is dead. Everybody's alive. Target eradicated. Right on time. <laughs> Horrible. Don't want to fly head on an interceptor. Don't have the health resistance, etc. Survivability. Die, computer guy. I think I might be about to blow up. Ah. Uh. Don't allow them to complete their attack run. Target neutralized. Yep. Records 81 kills. Come on, don't end. Come on. Oh. Bollocks. Man. Uh, Another victory uh, for the first oh well. order. Pretty good haul. And I did not catch him, but yeah, I mean.
How do you only have 20 kills in an interceptor? Oh well. That's me shooting lots of people and scoring lots of points. That's, I ranked up. That's not from this match. <laughs> anyway, I'm Nero D. Viral. Thanks for watching. I think I am going to play one more match, try and get my Yoda on. Get me a, another crate. Ten more of those. I haven't tried to, to do that yet. Only when I need. And then I have all the multiplayer fees. They've taken the base. Time to spring the trap. Maybe be in it. It's not defenseless. Destroy those generators. They power and, that laser. Yeah, excellent. First. On an Should grab that forty percent computer damage for the fighter. And use it Stop. like a bomber in these matches. Trash those generators. successful well done I owe you one. Ah, screwed up my double I was gonna try to make it a triple ability to be targeted for a second, I mean you can still shoot at them, but you can't target, you don't get a circle, but there's no bombers in here. That's about how you have to fire a missile. Yeah, see, he's still dodging. Almost there. Keep 
Keep knocking out those generators. Just press a button. <laughs> most of the time on most ships. And if not, you can. Wow. Oh. Finish this soon, or we'll have to retreat. I am plum tired. Our backup's here, dude. God, nothing. Are you serious? Just want to get Yoda. And Abilities two times each. Can't get my shield back up. Come on, God. This match has been so fast lately. It's so annoying. God. The two is whatever twice, and then his other one twice. I need five crystals for uh... Yeah,
taken the bait. Time to spring the trap. Sweet. Uh... Okay, why is he not targetable? What is going on? What? <laughs> I've lived long enough to do that thing twice. Enemies not do it. I'm an idiot. Invasive action. Almost there. Keep knocking Holy down shit. Yeah, that's too much in this. Crafting cards. Oh, God. My dumb ass, I forgot that that was there for one thing. Oh, well, I think I got two players with it. He said hit him. I think he said kill him. Oh, well. That's about the only situation you can hit people with. That's one out. down anyway. 
That makes you shoot harder at hey, whatever you're shooting at. So. Me. What the hell is that? Him? Our numbers are thinning. Finish this soon or we'll have to retreat. Don't get distracted! Hope to God I got my stupid two thingies in. <sighs> I had to use it more than twice. Oh well. Either way, get my crystals. Get my two afterburners. I had to, I didn't maybe let it go the whole time. Maybe that's why it mattered. I don't know. Oh well, I've got to get back to flying more. I've kind of been playing old Star Trek. Got a Klingon ship that can fire torpedoes while it's cloaked, or it comes out of cloak very quickly and goes back in pretty quick after you fire. Been playing around with that, it's pretty fun. Star Trek is at a very, it's a deep MMO as far as like powers and combinations and stuff, but uh, it's not hardcore as far as the instances. There's only you, there's no raids. It's only uh, what's it called? It's only like 10 to 20 minute instances, legit. One of them's about five minutes. And uh, no healers, you know, five person groups. Everybody's a DPS, or you might have a tank person, but. You know, nobody's supposed to be the tank and keep you alive with their immunity or something. Oh my god, I, I guess you have to do it and let it go the whole time. I probably canceled it. Oh well, either way, I got my crystals. So now... I can get my crate. I'm tired. I was tired three matches ago. Hey, cool. <laughs> Another Bosk card. Uh, my friend plays Bosk a lot, and I've got two blue Bosk cards today from Hero Crates, which is what I buy every time. Cool. Now the fighter, I, I think I'm gonna totally rework. I got got a purple card out of a box. That used to be 40%. It's just painful that it's only 20, even though that might be good because you do, you know, you do have the most health of the fighters. Obviously, those are done. It's not for that ship you want it. It's for these, you get the the last card level jump there, but you also get it for that, and that's what I've been thinking about doing, being a fast bomber, because it's just annoying that you can't get anywhere, and it'll make it easier to dodge missiles, 
But uh, you can do it anyway. I, I can anyway. I fly a lot. I like the flying games. That's always good. The, uh, I was talking to a friend of mine, you know, I'm trying to think. A lot of people watching may not be the greatest at flying. Uh, you fire missiles into things going head first, you know, at it. Uh, you know, the bomber has the armor to withstand the head to head, and uh, they're, you know, less likely to dodge your missile because they have less time. And it's really easy to dodge missiles now. You don't have to do my trick with flying in one direction fast and slowing down and Kurt and, uh, you know, doing a 180 about continuing to do that as the missile gets close to you and turns red on the little indicator, then you, you know, you're flying full speed, right? The missile indicator turns red, you slow down all the way, slam the throttle down, and flip your ship into a 180. You'll dodge the missile, do that a couple times, usually it's gone. Sometimes if you dodge it hard enough, it just goes away. Uh, anyway, this would help with that, but my thinking is to be like a fast, you know, you're a bomber, you're the slowest ship, so you're not gonna you're gonna get the slowest increase out of it, but uh, you need it. You could get to the target quicker, put the bombs on it faster. I don't know. Is that's that's cool, but it's only a one second increase on the uh, good guy ships or the light side ships. Only you know, woohoo. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this just cause. Because I don't think you get kills with the missiles anyway. I mean, you fire the missiles. I use all my missiles to hit targets. So yeah, it would help. <laughs> but... I don't know. I just think this would be cool. I think it would work. Engine upgrade. We'll go twice as fast. Then I'll go ahead and get that card too. And they, I like these three for the bomber. Uh, this is essential. Increase 40% on weapon overheating. Resistance to weapon overheating increase that is. 40% damage on the torpedoes. You're a bomber. You got two torpedoes. It's like getting you no know, 100. Uh, anyway. And yeah, my speed. And then uh, I'll get this one to the uh, top level. No, I'll get this one to the top level for when I'm on the bad guys. And it'll do increased 40% damage, which again, I don't really think you're gonna hit people, even though this one is the easy one to hit people with, because you can do it when you're flying right at them. It'll just find the targets for you. You might have to do it a little early. Uh, and you can always shoot it at a, you know, a stationary target or in a capital ship, an objective, you know. They, they get hit by missiles too, so that'll, you'll be able to do a crap ton of damage. And then I guess, I'm thinking when I'm on the other side or even when you're on that side, you know, if it's, it's a bunch of sharks out there shooting everybody, a bunch of aces, you can get there fast. Man, it should help with the maneuverability of that ship. Oh god, I should try it out, but I don't want to. Anyway, thanks for watching. This has been Nero D. Viral, babbling about Starfighter stuff for Battlefront 2. Do like and subscribe.